Bolsonaro's popularity continues to fall ahead of Brazil's 2022 election. According to a Datafolha poll released on Friday, former President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva continues to lead far-right President Jair Bolsonaro in voter choice for the 2022 election. Voting aid to Lula dropped from 46 in July to 44. According to the survey, Bolsonaro got a proportion point of 26, which requested the vote to make the election as if it had now been. Lula would win 56% of votes to the incumbent's 31 in a hypothetical runoff, compared to the incumbent's 58% to 31 led in the previous survey. Since July, the variance has been within the poll's margin of error. Additionally, other surveys indicate Lula's obvious lead as Bolsonaro's popularity declines as a result of increasing inflation, high unemployment, and his management of the world's second deadliest COVID-19 epidemic. That no contender has been declared for the October 2022 election. According to Datafolha, the poll found that Bolsonaro's September 7 rally to solicit support in his legal battle with the Supreme Court had had no effect on the election picture. Centrist candidates have also struggled to find momentum, frustrating parties seeking a third alternative to breaking up the divided Lula-Bolsonaro campaign. Left organizations who on 12 September called for a demonstration, nor Lula nor Bolsonaro, had failed to attract a lot of crowds from Sao Paulo. Voter support for the central left Democratic Labour Party Chiro Gomes, PDT, and the governors of the center-right Social Democratic Party of Brazil, PSDB, João Doria and Eduardo Leite continues in the single digits. Bolsonaro's popularity has plummeted to its lowest level since he took office in 2019. According to the Datafolha poll published on Thursday, 53 of respondents disapprove of him, up from 51 in the previous July survey. His favorable ratings dropped to 22 from 24, Datafolha said. Bolsonaro's assaults on the Supreme Court, the survey indicates, have failed to connect with people worried about increasing costs and a lack of employment. The Datafolha survey was conducted between the 13th to the 15th of September, questioning 3,667 Brazilians with a 2 percentage point error margin.